Radio people, get the f Whoa! <sighs> Sorry, I'm getting really hyped up and focused because it's another military video and I was, I'm getting ready, but I'm not alone. It's not anyone in the boys, but it's someone cool that everyone's been asking in the comments for. You know him, you love him. It's Nico. What's good? Hey! I'm here to be uh, loud and annoy everybody today. Dude, perfect. That's all my channel kind of is. I'm glad to have you. I've gotten a lot of people saying I should do a video with you and I love your content, so glad you're here. I appreciate it. And by the way, guys, in case you didn't know, he knows everything about everything because I didn't even know how to set this up and he literally fixed my entire OBS. So now my YouTube career set up and now I get to and do a video with him, so it's Let's perfect. go! By the way, that, uh, that, that class wasn't free. I'm gonna need your social security number, your firstborn child, and another two years of service in the military. I'm sorry. I'll do anything for you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Love your background, by the way. Super freedom, super hua. I mean, I'm I'm be trying to do something. I was jealous of yours, because you got them hot-looking YouTube play buttons. I got, like, some cute little silver ones in the back. Congratulations, by the way. My man out here doing Thanks. a mill, doing a milli. I'm trying, man. Hell yeah. So we are here today, mainly because we are going to react to the gang chamber the thing that as a joke i was like hey if you break the like record i might do that and you crushed it good job guys so now we're gonna react to what i'm gonna have to do eventually again this sucks one at home or something or i'm trying to contact some people on a base near me and go hey i'm a youtuber i'm a veteran already done this shit before but i want to do it again we'll make it happen i got you we went to the international sniper competition went to sniper school you want to do the gas chamber we'll set up <laughs> i'm just it's gonna have to happen <laughs> I'm ready for it. Get him. So this right here, this is what is gonna happen. Gas chamber. Oh, here it is. A better the gas person. chamber is actually the chemical, Lies. biological, radiological, and nuclear CBRN confidence chamber. What are they rubbing on their faces? The trainees learn about the- What are they rubbing on their faces? It's like a sponge. Right off the bat, way better gas mask than I ever had. Yep. They look great. I don't see any like ripped pants, blood, sweat, tears all over them. None of that. The pouches for them look brand fucking new. Dude, they get all the new shit. It's like them in Space Force, bro. They get everything new. We had like the old Vietnam moldy canteens to start with, and Thank the gas you. mask have been used for like 10 years. You had to like put like sometimes like a strap of 550 cord on two straps just to pull them together. This one looks like a like something that you would use for like professional paintball. Like this looks good. These look like good masks. I get so poopy about this shit. I want to know what those sponges are. Do they get to white clean their faces off before they go in? I think that's what they're doing. You know how like you can get a shaving profile because your skin is sensitive or whatever oh but my, since you know yeah. uh, military standards have dropped okay so people who are actually failing requirements are getting in now yep. so uh maybe their skin they don't want to get upset you know have a bad day they have eczema my skin sensitive well, all right so we got they got cool new gear cool new, like new shit and they got sponges look at their boot ties the pant bosses themselves look at this fucking dude look at this m50 field protective mask or gas mask they then develop confidence in the mask's protective capability in the chamber exercise. Where they look really happy and not scared. Handling. The, the dude's right waving. The, the man's camera. waving. Kids oh, up. so this is fun to you. Okay. Yeah. Gas mask and how to calmly place it on their head and breathe. Bro, it ain't no way! To calmly place it on their head and breathe. How does this train you for anything, bro? I never remember being deployed at any point in time, getting shot at and being like, hey, Calm, good time I'm having right now. I need to be in a calm, stable environment. You need to give me a second to put on this gas mask while you're throwing that tear gas and all that other chemical shit that you're not supposed to in my face. Hold on. Hold on, I got it clear. Take your time. Take your time, buddy. Sorry, one of my filters isn't working. Hold on. Okay. Hey, it's okay. Do you want a whole new mask? Actually, yeah. No, if you could do that, that'd be great for me. It, I actually, would love you don't even mask. have to do this. I'm so sorry to waste your time. Do you really? just want to pass basic training as a civilian and come out a civilian? Because we can do that too. I would love that. Say less. <laughs> Calm environment. Get the f out of here, bro. This exercise exposes trainees to a simulated toxic environment by using CS gas. Also known as mm -hmm. tear gas. C okay. It CS is a gas. substance yeah. that is used as. Who pick up your damn mask? Did someone toss their mask? I was like, "There's no way." Look at this. Look at this bullshit. Also known as tear gas. It They're is just kicking it around, dude. You would have gotten grabbed <laughs> and dragged back in, and it would have been like low crawl and get your mask, <laughs> yeah. pick it up, then you can go. Ooh. Brother. And they're walking out too fast. You're not, you shouldn't be able to walk out that fast because there was like a pace. Yeah. And it'd be like, uh, you, you get marched out. My eyes are open and my arms are flapping. And you gotta. The flappy bird. 
Flappy Bird! <laughs> oh man, I, I might be able to find a clip from Basic because uh, we had a little clip in there from my old Basic training. We were in the good old uh, ACUs, and uh, I caught myself doing them good old bird flaps. Little birdie flaps. And there's always that one drill sergeant that's in there without a mask because he does it all the time, just like. Yeah, he's like. He's like. <clears throat> <sighs> <laughs> We're only 38 seconds into this shit. Riot control agent. Okay. He's non-lethal and builds the trainees' confidence in their gear. Uh-huh. With the understanding dude, that the they masks totally let them run out as fast as they wanted to. Do whatever they want. Dude. I would like to know how long they actually made them stay in there for. That's what I'm saying, because, like, I don't know what they did for you guys, but you got us in there. We did the whole ducks in a row bullshit. We took off the mask, and then we had to yell the soldier's creed until we all finished it. Then we were allowed to go out. And then they make you drop, like, your home address and, like, all this yeah. other stuff. Maybe yeah. a pop quiz. You were had 300 on the uh, APFT, which means you were a physical stud. Yeah, then yeah, you had yeah. to stay in there and you had to do a push-up competition. Yeah. So, Got him, dumbass. <laughs> Got him. Oh, you want to be strong? We're going to see how strong you are. We're going to make you <laughs> army strong, okay? <laughs> <laughs> this experience gives them confidence as what? they what is this what the whoa dude dude second guy second guy look at his face bro they did not stay in there long enough they did not stay they in there did long not bro. stay in there long enough you should have snot to snot the knees dripping. bro look at his snot, name red face everything look at his name poindexter no way no this is not happening right now hey that's a drill sergeant's dream right there bro <gasps> Hey, where's Private Point Dexter? Where I'm are you right here? Where? I'm over here. I don't see you. I'm right here. Oh, look at you. Look at you. I just remember coming out, getting five seconds of my life to myself, and then rolling in the dirt, yep. and then back to getting smoked because someone something up somebody decided to hold their breath in the gas chamber and pretend to breathe so we're going again good job guys now understand some of the basic protective They're measures that must be taken against out. cbrn weapons what? or hazards if or they're just studs. Oh, that dude, that's, that that's the just, only dude who that's did That's the it only right. dude. He spit. He, that, that's it. Yeah. He's like, he's like, oh, God. <laughs> this, there, and then here's this, this dude over here just with a camera like, yeah, yeah, this, I get paid for this. F yeah. Of course, it's the understanding that soldiers must be ready to There fight. we go. That was a real reaction. You see that shit? Yeah, she's like, she's like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> ready to fight regardless of the circumstance whoa oh, oh there you oh, go oh she picked it up though then she picked hey, it up she gets it she knows let's go hell yeah you <laughs> know for a fact for a fact your drill sergeant will fuck you up bro got the yeah, e might be a better company got the, trying to get that fuzz off the ground dude get sticks out of it yeah maybe my man's just like it's a he nothing is, <laughs> he's having a good old time bro <laughs> I did it. I made it. I did it. Yay. <laughs> Thumbs up. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Uh-huh. Death. Request in the comments. How about I want start to finish. No cuts. No edits. Every single word. How long they were in there for. What you made him do after. Thank you. All of the above. I see no suffering. There. That's what being a soldier or service member is all about. You got to suffer. Breakthrough, okay? Or else it's just the civilian sector mindset. It is the whole idea of basic training. They are supposed to break you mentally and physically and build you back up as a soldier. Where's the soldier shit? Why are you not crying in the dirt? That's Still crazy, man. I'm Still actually good. super disappointed. This whole suffering aspect, which is how it was built off of, yeah. is just not in a bad way. Like It builds you, right? It tested you. Yeah, they, they test you in any way, shape, or form. You don't go to basic training a civilian yeah. to come out a civilian. You go Go to basic training to come out a soldier. Like that's that's what it is. It's almost like they're training you for war. Bro, that's scary though. I didn't sign up for this. That, that's war scary. You mean I actually gotta go do shit? This is what they should do for people if they got like drafted and like they have to be in a support role. Dude, this is ridiculous. It, don't tell me this whole thing is just gonna be the like the. Okay, there we go. Yeah. Oh, that yeah. was a good one. That was a good one. Hey! Oh, they're all f them. Let's Hell go! Yeah. Hey! <laughs> now this is what Man. we came to see right here. Yeah. Show that sh there you go. Suffer. Suffer. <laughs> <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. 
That's what I want to see. <laughs> Everyone coming out there, spuking and pewing like freaking Arnold at the gym, bro. Freaking. <laughs> did you throw up or did you have anybody who like threw up when they went there? I spat a lot. My nose ran. I didn't throw up, but the whole my nose felt like a waterfall. I had the exact same thing. And it was yeah. actually a huge blessing because I had that like basic training sickness where you get like that terrible cold. Yes. And as soon as you after you got exited the gas chamber, it was like the breathe. best mix of like any kind of like airborne cure melatonin like multivitamin shit all like nasal drip all in one it was the best feeling ever especially going to sleep that night even though my face was on fire the rest of the day you and never to, breathed like, better like through your nose after that though those experiences there's nothing better yeah it's such a good feeling so they're pulling it out there we go okay there this fucking guy he gets oh it God. he was haste with it how fucking quit this guy is look at this he goes. He goes. He's, win. He's just not trying to get yelled at or be a buddy fucker for the entire platoon. He was just hot. He he that 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 one dude, he passes. He's good. He can whip that shit, cleared it, he's done. Yo, what the f they feed in this guy? Look at the difference. It's like it's it's like you're in a dead zone with Verizon and then it just goes boom, city. <laughs> and then you get that drop signal. Ew. There we go. Okay, there we go. Uh, Little. Uh, oh, come on. We need uh, the coughing. Okay. That's I what would I wanted not to bring see. Bring a single one of these dudes into a fire team. No. Nope. They all look super soft. I feel like what actually would allow me to make a better comparison is if I could see them before and after, like when they were getting smoked. Yeah. They were just able to like snap out of it for the like my eye, my eyes are I burning. I can't do it. <laughs> I can't. Say. Bitch, I can't see up. Oh my god. <laughs> Where's my service dog at? Rufus. Right out there with a stick, just like looking another girl. I'm legally blind. Joyce, uh, I dropped my magazine. Well, where is it? Pick it up. Oh no. He's just like fiddling around with his <laughs> rifle. Like... Holy shit, dude. Okay, okay. Oh, he was trying to shrug it off. Oh, was that a, a yeah. cadre in the back that was Yeah. That was going in? My man just goes like no he, mask? Just, he just walks out no mask. Like, look at this. Blah. Bro, oh. yeah, yeah, that's why I like the bro. He came out there with the phone like, "What's up, motherfucker?" Look at him. He's just like, man, these these new privates these days. Yeah, they're he, bitches. He's, he's mad about his phone, bro. He's like, "Fuck, I lost service inside." Bro. <laughs> my phone's dead. You know he only did that so that way when they all are in formation, they're like, <laughs> he's like, "Do I look up to you guys? Shut the fuck up! <laughs> Shut up!" But Sergeant, but, but, shut up. But he's not having it, bro. He's like, I'm in there texting on my phone, having a good old time. Man, it must be nice for you to flap your arms and cry about it while I'm texting and all these bitches. Holy shit. And those in the gas chamber, baby. Let's, let's go. Let's go. Third divorce. Let's get it, baby. <laughs> uh, smiling. Bro, I would be like, do not look at the fucking camera. If I catch you looking at the camera, mm. I'm going to fuck you up. Oh, Don't you do it. Oh. oh, okay. All right. You want your five seconds of fame? I get it. I understand. You want to be the center of attention. That's fine. Yep. Hey, everybody, go back in again, and you, you're going to stand in the center right next to the CS gas, since you love to be the center of attention. Yeah, you get to high five everybody on the way out. Too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, this is all about you, right? That's the number one thing I think I hate the most, and the, probably the first thing I get into every time I do a reaction on, like, military stuff is yeah. you see everybody being so happy and in, engaging with the cameras and yep. stuff. I remember when we went in, if, like, the army came around to shoot like a promo or something, which yep. they do because they're trying to find content all the time. The drill sergeant will pull us in and be like, if you guys look at that fucking camera, yep. I swear to God, yep. you. and you're just like, I don't even see cameras. I don't know what they are. Big brother doesn't exist. Is this a new rule? Because I, I noticed this, like for hair regulations. Oh yeah. So Air Force got like the primary change in uh, Air Force regulations. And so that caused like things in AR670-1 to uh -oh. change up a little bit. Now you can do braids, ponytails. You okay. don't have to chop your hair. Uh, anymore apparently either so i'm like okay i know one nice. of the yeah like when we were in it's like no sorry figure it out i did realize the the one thing that they also changed with hair they're changing shit with beards uh-huh -uh. Uh if it is part of your like religion or something like that <clears throat> nordic you can have a beard oh shit because aren't we like one of the only armies in the world that like care about shaving yeah to be fair the reason we are back to back 
World War fucking Champs <laughs> is because we did True. realize that like with having hair equals hygiene standards and poor hygiene was mm -hmm. one of the reasons people were dying left and right, not being able to fight properly. Let's say people are having long hair, things are getting jammed, their hair is catching on fire. Like, you know, we're going back to then in those times. And oh, yeah. Adapted yeah, to for having, sure. Like, clean shaving and all this other stuff. So I'm like, it makes sense, but we're the only ones who have kept that standard. But you want to know who doesn't keep up to those standards? Special operations. They got beards. Apparently, they everyone's special forces now, bro. They're bringing it to garrison you know the the super slick guys that run around you know that you see on base sometimes that are only in civvies that look like they can kill you with a week <laughs> Full beard. that's pretty cool that they're changing some stuff up that's pretty nice would have been cool if i was yeah. in but whatever god damn uh -huh. all right oh he's drooling he cool one. nice <laughs> Oh, that's a good one yeah that's hey, a good one. hey there we go there that's we what i was go. expecting the whole time point that oh, okay that was it all right well yeah everybody that is essentially what i'm gonna be uh trying to go for but uh if i do it you'll see probably me saying the soldier's creed in there snot rockets maybe puke it'll be fun but thank you so much everybody for staying to the end of the video uh if you stay to the end you're awesome and no one can take that away from Goated. you nico is there any final words that you want to say have a great day don't be a bitch it's actually really well said <laughs> Said with love because I care about you. True. Because I care about your safety. Make sure to check out Nico's channel because we have a spicy video that we did with him as well. It'll be down in the description below. And uh, thank you all so much again. Goodbye. Hey, yo, let's go do some fing PT in this bitch. <laughs>